Hello, I'm Robert Dvorak. The following video is a field study that I did to prepare for a larger painting at Greywell Cove, a beach between Montera and Pacifica on the California coast. There are 137 stairs down to this beach, one of my favorites on the California coast. The following is a small field study demonstration painting for my watercolor workshop. It has been speeded up. There we go. I'm trying to get some really dark color there. These rocks in. More brown. What browns do you have there? Hmm? What brown are you? That's uh, burnt sienna. I'm going to try to leave just a, a few little a few little um, whites in there, just a few whites. See, just a just a little bit of whites in there to help show the uh, the direction of the the rock strata. And then I got this wave coming in here. Now let's do this one here. I'm using the point of the brush. I want to get, I want to get that strata, and I'm using the side of the brush and letting the spray come up, a little yellow ochre. More yellow ochre. Try to be careful that I don't paint out all the all my water. And this rock here, see, get these are coming down like that. And this rock is down here. I'll try to make this a little bit different color, also to help define it as something different. At least for this field study, I may not do the same on the painting, but I want to distinguish this one from the background. Okay, and then we have the ocean, which is kind of greenish, isn't it? So I'm using some hooker's green and some blue, fallow blue, hooker's green, and some raw sienna. Let's do that. Get, get my density gradient in here. Okay, and then we have just a few, few lines here. My water. So it really painting negative it's negative painting, all right? Maybe here. And we so and then down on the beach, we've got this. Here. Now I do need my clip. It's my paper starting to blow. Just a just a little bit of very light color here, very light. So always think of your painting as going beyond the edges of your border. Maybe a little bit of just a tad of dark in here. And the spray. Oh. oh wow! Isn't that something else, huh? And that's something, wow. I think I'm gonna go ahead and put in this horizon line here. I wasn't going to, but I think I wanna do that. Get that horizon line in there. And then maybe I'm gonna come, since I want this rock to be really distinctive, I have to come back in and put some dark behind it. 
like that. That makes it show better, huh? And you do that. So can you feel the water going around there? Yeah. I hope so. Isn't this a nice spot here? This is one of my favorite spots right here. I love this, this spot right here. After answering some of the questions that the students asked me, I went ahead and put more blue in my sky and then I added some beach and some white foam coming in from the waves with a little shadow against the white foam on the beach. <laughs> 